Hello there. What do you think is your most powerful marketing tool? My name is Peter Beckenham, and I'd like to share a few thoughts with you. I mean, would your most powerful marketing tool be ChatGPT, your social media posts, your email list, your podcast, your YouTube channel? Which one of those would it be? Let me tell you, none of the above. Your most powerful marketing tool, and it's free, is you. Yes, I'm suggesting you come up with stories about you. Think about experiences from your life and your business that you can share with people that lets them see a bit behind the scenes about you and your business. And let them see, know, and more importantly, feel the emotions that were associated with those little experiences, whatever they may be. I want you to have the courage to be personable and vulnerable when you share your snippets from your life and your business experiences, especially vulnerable. Now, you may be thinking, oh, what can I share? I mean, there are lots of experiences we've all had in our life, right? Now, some of them are extremely private, and you don't want to share those, obviously. But there are many experiences that you've had. If you sit down and think about it, there are many experiences that you had that you could share with people that would get them to understand and appreciate you a little bit more and also your business. So just select some simple little experiences. And these experiences need only be the ones who feel comfortable in sharing anyway, all right? When you do this, it will give people a deeper understanding and appreciation of you. They will give certain people a memorable moment, a memorable experience with you, because some will relate and definitely resonate with you. And those are the people who will become part of your very valuable community, your very valuable audience. You don't want to attract everybody. You just want to attract people who resonate with you, right? That's why you are your most powerful marketing tool. So go spend some time and create some little stories. And don't just create them, use them. Whether you do it in text format or the more powerful way of doing it is in a little video like this, it's up to you. I've even used short stories on social media that reflect the values I stand for. And then towards the end of the short story, I ask people to message me if they'd like to know a little bit more how they can use things like this in their business. So it's another way of promoting yourself in a very nice, non-threatening way. And it also lets people into getting to appreciate you more as a person. It's the same thing, right? Now, if you're not sure, use the link on the screen and come and talk to me and I'll give you some help. PeterBeckenham.com forward slash our slash conversations okay just remember your sharing will be an inspiration to many people and particularly to people who resonate and relate to you because people love reality and authenticity and transparency as well as vulnerability sure people are looking for leadership from people who have the expertise to solve their problem but more importantly, they're looking for people who have the expertise, but also that they feel comfortable with and that they can trust. And guess what? Sharing you will help you become a trusted authority with your target audience. It's that darn simple. It's so simple, it's powerful. Yes, sharing about you is way more impactful than any advertising campaign you'd ever do. So come and talk to me if you're not sure. And I'll also share a little video about how to build your story, okay? Until next time, best wishes from Thailand. Cheers for now.